Hi, welcome to GC Motors. Today I'm going to talk you around our 2018 Jaguar E Pace D150 HSE that's just come into stock. Uh, it's a lovely car, this, really nice example. Uh, so, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you around the whole car through the exterior, through the interior. We'll go through all the features and I'll show you the condition of uh, absolutely everything. So, yeah, we'll start down at the front. So, there will be some age related wear and tear due to age and mileage, as you'd expect. We guarantee no scratches through the paintwork, no dents and no scuffs on the alloy wheels. So here at GC Motors in Harrogate on Ripon Road, we've got a service and preparation centre on site. And we've also spent about £2 million recently investing in a body shop. It's fully equipped. And um, what this means is that we can uh, put all of our vehicles through the same rigorous process and they all get prepped to the same high standard. You can see that cesium paint looking really good down there. Around the side, these 20 inch gloss black alloy wheels. So, the tyres on there, that's again as part of our check off process. So, our guys in the workshop will look over them, make sure there's plenty of tread, plenty of life left on them. So, gloss black window surrounds, rear privacy glass as we just move around to the back of the E pace. So, there you go, it's twin exhausts. Chrome badging. So it's a really well spec car, this, so it comes with a panoramic roof. It's also got the uh, tow bar at the rear. It's got a 360 surround view camera and Meridian sound system. All of that stuff we'll see as we uh, as we go around. We just open the boot now. Take a look in here. So you can see a pretty good sized boot, and it's uh, also in really good condition. It's nice and clean. Power closing boot, so we just press that button there. That'll pop the boot down for us, just close that tailgate. Yeah, you can see it, D150 all wheel drive badging there. We just look down the driver's side. Again, that lovely cesium blue paint. That's looking really good. Next up, we'll, uh, we'll jump inside. We'll start in the back seats. So there we go, light oyster leather. Really striking interior color. So we'll just take a look through. Rear isofix and those rear seats. And that lovely kind of diamond pattern stitching, you can see this leather's in really good condition. Obviously, it can be a tricky one to keep clean, the lighter coloured leather, but it's the, the previous owners obviously looked after this car very well, looking really neat and tidy. That leather looks great. So, we just take a look behind the, behind the passenger side now. Again, same on this side. It's all looking fantastic. So we'll jump into the front now on the passenger side. So the uh, front seats are electrically adjustable and they're also memory as well. So you can see there you've got your different memory settings. So you know different drivers, different passengers using the car. They can uh, have that set up to their preference. You could also see there that Meridian badge on the sound system. Yeah, they need great systems in Jaguars and Land Rovers. If we take a look down the passenger seat now, you can see the, uh, the leaping Jaguar emblem embossed on the headrest. And there you go, all your controls for the seat on the side there. Plenty of adjustability in that. So we just sweep past our showroom here. We'll take a look into the driver's side. memory settings and all your window and wing mirror controls. We'll take a 
a look at the driver's seat and just sneak that at the uh, the panoramic roof up above that's letting all that extra light in the cabin. We'll take a closer look at that uh, later on. For now, let's jump inside and I'll talk you through some of the interior features. So here we go, you can see keyless start. So foot on the brake, press the button there and the engine will fire into life. You've got your multifunction steering wheel here with your cruise control on the right. And the infotainment and navigation settings there on the left. There's your cruise control and speed limiter also. Now on the dashboard itself, you've got the uh, traffic sign assist there, so that it lets you know what the speed limit is on the road that you're on. Just take a look at the central infotainment screen now, so your DAB radio on here. And obviously you can see satellite navigation there. Yeah, nice big di display in these e-paces, and that's, uh, that's not a glitch there on the screen, that's just the way that the camera's picking up the light, so uh, nothing to worry about there at all. There we go, pop the car into reverse, you can see that reversing camera comes up, and here's your 360 surround view camera. So you get that great view, kind of top down view, you see exactly what's going on around the car. You know, if you're backing into a space, you can also use that conventional reversing camera with the guidelines as well. The screen here, you can see Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. If you want to get your phone hooked up to the infotainment system, that makes it really nice and simple, nice and easy to use. And then extra features, there's that deployable tow bar that I mentioned earlier on. See so down here, your dual zone climate control settings. Just beneath that, your automatic gear selector there. So your controls there for the uh, adaptable drive modes. Okay, so we'll just step out now. Let's take a look up. You can see a lovely panoramic roof. It's a great big glass element here. Lets all that extra light in the cabin. It's a really nice feature on the E-Pace. It makes it feel nice and spacious inside. Yeah, really luxurious. It's great to have. It goes really nicely with the kind of light oyster uh, coloured leather interior. So we'll jump out now. We'll take one last look at the outside of the car. So there we go, that's been our 2018 Jaguar E-Pace D150 HSE in cesium blue with a light oyster interior on those 20 inch gloss black alloys. So this will be live on our website now. You can take a look at it on there, you can read through this full specification, look through all the photos and also all the details will be on there on how to get in touch with us. So I hope this video has been useful. Cheers.